Time with that pin of Brody Teske of Iowa last Friday night to really ignite the Nittany Lions and routes their 39th straight dual meet victory. Mendez last weekend, couple of impressive victories, beat Dylan Ragus in a Michigan 3 1 and sudden victory. And then against fingers, Rayvon guys. Foley Out of, of Michigan Not State, fingers. got a takedown in the final seconds to get the major decision. What are you looking for, Jim, in the first minute? Well, I'm looking for elbow. Mendez. Probably not to look for, to just kind of stay in this match and see if he can match the athletic ability here of, of RBY when he tries to take his quick shots. You know, what you don't want to do is fall into what Teske fell into last week here where he shot across the body late in the match. Right there, very well aware of that go-behind right there. Nice reactions there by Mendez. RBY, two-time Big Ten champion, has won 46 in a row. Second behind Spencer Lee's 49 straight for the national lead. No score, 60 seconds in. And Mendez is getting to that inside bicep tie right there on the inside. Of Sayre, that's where he wants to be. Now he's over the top of it. So I'm looking at that left hand of, of Mendez, and he wants to be right there on that inside, control that inside tie, and that keeps RBY off the shot temporarily. Right there, blocking out there, nice thumb block. Now he has control of the leg, control of the arm right there. Mendez, a true freshman from Crown Point, Indiana, a four-time Indiana State Buffalo champion. Abbott. Right there, you see RBY is going with that right hand around the, the elbow right there. Look for him to go ahead and either snap that down, some sort of shock moves, maybe even hit a duck under. 115 here in the first, 6 0 Ohio State. Ali Kaiseman with a fall to give the Buckeyes a 6 0 lead early. You got a minute, Jess. You got a minute. Good sequence so far here by Mendez. Like I said, he wants to be on that inside bicep tie. RBY has not gotten him off of that. Now he moves out of position and usually likes to hit, it, hit that little snap down right there, the little snap down action. 45 ticks remaining in the first. 40. Mendez with a big win at the Michigan State Open Offense, over guys. Lucas Bird to claim that title. There's wow. a shot by RBY. And beautiful. gets that finish. That is beautiful. Oh, it's just so typical of his wrestling here lately. He's been able to go ahead in that last 30 seconds. Now a great situation for Mendez to be able to get out and turn in. He's got to try to turn back in, but when Roman Bravo Young wants to stay with you, he will go ahead and use his lower body as active. He drives right through. He's in a situation right now where he really wants to cut the clock. Another look at that takedown from RBY, and lickety split. Yeah, he had the inside bicep control that time, and nice job of, you know, he, he really kind of finished that technique with his head. He's really jerked his head right into the rib cage right there. Big 13 seconds off this restart. This is where RBY is so good. You see that pressure on the left side. Hooks Scoop, that ankle. Scoops that near leg. That was really important. He buys him enough time. Finishes the period on top. Tom Ryan, the head coach at Ohio State, came to Columbus in 2006 after 11 seasons at Hofstra. And he has been fantastic, leading the charge to that team title in 2015. They've won three Big Ten titles five times. They've been second place. Phenomenal job as Mendez starts second period on bottom. Against a guy like RBY, Jim, how do you get out? <laughs> That's just the million dollar question. <laughs> that really is it. Because <laughs> even the best in the country haven't been able to do it when he wants to stay in that position. So Mendez doing a nice job of getting escape here. Riding time up to 50 seconds for RBY. Really nice work there, though, for Mendez. We know how tough Center. RBY can be in that top position. So a 2 1 match. Center. Again, what Mendez has been able to do with that left hand was get to the inside bicep tie and come hard with that collar tie, but, but then left that uh, his right arm, gave up the inside bicep tie, and, and RBY was able to Good. go ahead and get to that right leg so quickly. You know, and, and he's, he's the guy that has a shot to both sides, okay? So you, can all, you can't really Offense. defend one side or the other, and his quickness is really just the elevator here where he just ends up Got a minute. Minute picking guys apart. Underhook there on the left side by the Buckeye Mendez inside of a minute here in this second period. Russell out of it. Watch your hands. Keep manipulating the head. And yeah, 40, active, yes. uh, with his hands right there is Mendez. This is where RBI struck in the first period. 
Yeah, last, he's so dangerous in the last 30 seconds of periods. And I know he shot a little bit before that, but you know, look for him to get on the offense, maybe see if he try, tries to attack the other side of the body. Touch and go. Yes. 15, shrug. Shrug that off of that elbow tie right there. Great job there, good net return, settles back down. Second takedown of the match. You can set your watch to it. Just so good. Scores late in the second, finishes period on top again. He's in control, four to one. George Gray. Kale Sanderson, 14th season at PSU. The Nittany Lions have won nine of the last 11 NCAA titles. Five Hodge Trophy winners. Take a Check look this, at this out. Yeah, take a look at this elbow shuck right there. Just elbow pass right through. It has a lot of rotation right there as he brings it across and good quick go behind and Matt return. Just so impressive. You said it, Jim. I mean, you can set your clock to it late in periods. You better be Three ready minutes. against Darby Y. Neutral. Just so sound in all areas, technically great awareness. And relaxed, you know, just that, 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 that nothing ever seems to get him down. And when you do get to those hips, as we've seen in the past, I mean, you know, all last season, guys were able to get there, but they just can't finish. I'd be what relaxed too, Jim, if I had that skill set. Yeah, you, you, it's, this is cool in a singlet right there. Silky smooth RBY. Right there, a nice little pick and snatch right there. Remember, that's the back leg right there he's attacking. Able to go ahead and get it. Now the roll through. Good solid mat return. Trying to get on your show. <laughs> this is tough wrestling because it's been short time scoring. Very offensive, finishing periods on top. Good awareness on the edge with the return. Yeah. Well done. Yep, right here, far ankle. Anticipates the roll throughs. Notice how he got his feet back and put his knees on the mat. That's what. That's the type of action you want to see on those roll throughs. I'm going to put you on the spot here. What's something with his wrestling that he could improve on? Anything? I mean, of course he can get better in all areas, but I don't see a weakness with him, Jim. No, he's attacking both sides of the body. We've seen before where he's had great defense, and he just seems to be in a, always in a position to score. And, you know, he's been able to do all this mainly in the middle of the mat. He doesn't get pushed around. And I think I think you can credit a lot of his high-caliber opponents, Austin DeSanto. When he first got in the, in the uh, you know, in the conference as a freshman, you know, a lot of times gave some, gave some ground up, you know. Mendez doing a nice job off his techniques where he's trying to rush him here. I like what he's doing. RBY looking for bonus points. He's got 15 seconds. Can he get the major? Comes back out. He's so got a foot sweep in this situation. See the Ohio State coaching staff don't really want Bendez to go with, big with anything. There's that inside trip. Fought off really well with the wizard. With the riding time points, an 8-2 decision for Roman Bravo Young. 